Okay, what's going on guys? Let's do this problem right here. So we have these two functions we have to integrate. But before we do this, we have to know two trick identities in order to do it, in order to do these problems. So let's see what are those. So first one is sine square x that is equal to half times one minus cos two x cos two x dx cos 2x that's all yeah and then uh, cos square x is going to be plus half times 1 minus uh, 1 plus cos 2x so these are the two trick identities we have to know before we approach these questions so let's see what we can do right here here if you notice uh, cos square x right cos square x pattern so I can do I can use this one right here and if you notice, if it's x, it's increased by 2, like it's multiplied by 2. If it's 3x, it's going to be 6x, right? It doubles. So let's write this one in terms of that format. So here we can do half times 1 plus cos 6x dx. And this is our thing. And now what I can do, I can multiply everything by half. Mm. Oh, I bring the half in front of the integral and do the integra integration first. So we're going to have 1 plus cos 6x dx. And if I integrate this one, this is going to be half. The in integral of 1 is going to be just x plus integral of cos x is going to be sine x. So it's going to be sine. 6x divided by this number that's 6 plus constant and all you have to do is simply multiply by half that's going to give us half x plus sine 6x divided by 12 12 plus constant and that is the answer for this question let's do this one right here here we have to do the same thing what we have to do first of all we divide this one into sine square sine square so we can write this one as sine square x whole square dx. Now instead of sine square x, I'm just going to use the first formula right here. That is integral of half times 1 minus cos 2x whole square, right? That is whole square dx. Now uh, what I can do here, let's square both of them. So here we have half square and 1 minus cos 2x square and dx. Half square is basically 1 over 4. I can write that one in front. Integral of here I can write 1 minus cos 2x two times. 1 minus cos 2x, 1 minus cos 2x dx. So let's multiply, so let's separate this one. Maybe use a different color, okay. So one over four, if I multiply this one, okay, one over four here, right here. And if I multiply this one, it's only one minus cos two x. Then if I multiply minus cos two x by one, it's gonna be minus cos two x again then minus cos 2x minus cos 2x it's going to be plus cos square 2x all together dx right and we can simplify simply simplify furthermore it's going to be 1 minus 2 cos 2x 2 cos 2x plus cos square 2x dx again we have a cos square 2x right here. You can again do the this one right here. You can choose this one. So that's going to give us 1 over 4 integral of 1 minus 2 cos 2x plus instead of this one, I plug these values. So this is going to be half times 1 plus cos 4x because 2x doubles 4x cos 4x. Um, dx 
then let's multiply everything by half so here we are going to have 1 minus 2 cos 2x plus half plus cos 4x cos 4x divided by 2 dx right dx now this one is easy to integrate but before that I have to add these two together like 1 plus half that's going to be 3 by 2 so half integral 3 by 2 minus 2 cos 2x plus cos 4x divided by 2 dx so let's simplify this one furthermore now I can do the integration so this is going to be 3 by 2x minus 2 cos cos 2x divided integral of cos is sine 2 sine 2x divided by 2 plus sine 4x divided by 4 times 2 8 dx and uh, that is almost our answer and this is not dx this is constant right this is constant and all we have to do is simply multiply everything by half so if I multiply everything by half hmm, this is 1 over 4 1 over 4 if I multiply everything by 1 over 4 this is going to be 3 by 8 x minus 2 2 2 cancels so it's going to be just sine x over 4 sine 2x over 4 sine 2x over 4 plus sine 4x over 32 plus constant and that is our final answer i hope you guys like this video see you next time